Well, traffic over I-35 in West Adams is still causing headaches for drivers as TxDOT continues to work on the area. The big problem, new traffic lights that aren't synced up are backing cars up for blocks. Channel 6's Barry Roy is there live right now with how it's looking for people heading home from work. Barry. Yeah, good evening to you, uh, Imani. Traffic cones still up. There are lanes that are still closed. There's a lot of confusion as drivers, well, they just try to navigate new roadways. And TxDOT says it's not over yet. Be patient. That's the official word from TxDOT tonight. As drivers continue to navigate the new roadway over I-35 in Temple and both Central Avenue and West Adam. There are still lanes that are closed and striping that needs to be completed along the new roads, but that's not the biggest issue left. And then there's still some synchronization that needs to take place, not with necessarily with the signals there at Adams and Central, but between the signals at Adams and Central and 31st Street. Those signals, Robert says, are controlled by automated cameras, which looks at traffic at a specific signal, which then allows a certain amount of that traffic to pass through. He says those cameras are set dependent upon human observations from engineers who program. Some of these traffic patterns might change over the next few days and weeks, so be aware every time you come through, just make sure you're focused on where you are and where you need to be. Cody Williams of the Temple Police Department knows that drivers get frustrated, but traffic laws still apply. Confusion on the road doesn't make you less responsible. Just because you have a green light, if the intersection ahead of you is full, if there's no place for you to go, don't pull out into the intersection and, and block the lane. According to the city of Temple, most traffic fines like blocking the intersection, illegal lane changes, and running red lights could cost you upwards of $200. The actual cost, however, is determined by the facts and circumstances of the case. There may be a considerable backup. So how much longer? Ken says, be patient. Totally, lanes open, striping, synchronization at the 31st Street. Uh, with 31st Street and Adams and Central within about three weeks. Yeah, Imani, we'll bring you back out live here to 31st and West Adams. Uh, as Ken says, if drivers could use an alternate route, that would help with con congestion. Also, we are told tonight by Cody Weems of the Temple Police Department, there is no plans right now for extra patrols through for officers through here. We'll certainly stay on top of this story. We'll also stay here for 6 o'clock and let you know how traffic is flowing. Reporting live in Temple, Barry Roy, Channel 6 News. All right, thank you, Barry.